Hey guys, DRG Vano here. As you can see, I have some more Final Fantasy Freddy's Pizzeria Simulator custom action figures. This time I have Rockstar Nightmare, Rockstar Fourth Closet Freddy, Rockstar Helpy Freddy, and Rockstar Molten Freddy. So let's take a look at Rockstar Nightmare. I know he was supposed to be featured, in, well I didn't mention it, he was supposed to be featured in the last one, but the more I thought about it, I decided to place him with these guys because it kind of looks better with them. I don't know why, it just doesn't look right with those other ones at least i'm saying at least that's what i think like the color scheme wise uh he's pretty much painted black while these guys are painted white with some black especially with rockstar fourth closet freddy but that's just my opinion i don't know how all of you guys look or even care you know but overall i like how he came out and he was also one of the other customs i kind of didn't want to paint similar to uh, Rockstar Red Bear and even some of these guys I kind of didn't want to paint them at first but I don't know if I said this before I kind of bought too many action figures so I decided to paint them because why not I do like how he looks and now let's look at Rockstar 4th Closet Freddy similar to the fun time 4th Closet Freddy I decided to make one for Rockstar Freddy I do like the color scheme. I really like the eyes overall. You know, at least I like the eyes. Everything else is pretty much the same color scheme. Just like with the Rockstar, uh, Funtime Party version. The fourth closet one. Pretty much the same except for the silver's paint replaced with the uh, black. I was gonna make that silver, but I decided to make it a black color. Next one we have is Rockstar Helpy Freddy. I was debating on, when I was doing the tutorial videos, you'll see that in the near future. I was debating on what I should call him. Should I call him Rockstar Helpy or Rockstar Helpy Freddy? So, I decided to call him Rockstar Helpy Freddy because he's technically Rockstar Freddy with Helpy's color scheme. I do like the overall appearance. I was going to make that red, but I decided to give it a bright, uh, not a bright yellow, just a regular yellow color. I do like how it looks overall. I forgot the feet were painted all purple. So, I was originally going to paint the toes purple, but I forgot the whole feet are purple. And I also forgot about to paint these as well, but I added them on at the last minute. And last, but certainly not least, we have <clears throat> Rockstar Molten Freddy. Again, this was more of a last resort one. I actually did paint the limbs on. I do have them with me right here. I do have the legs, as you can see right there. Uh, and the other arm. Uh, I don't know what happened to the other hand. I can't find it, honestly. But I do have them just in case. These parts were a last resort and spare parts I have. This is just circ um, <clears throat> Scrap Baby's hand, as you can tell. I just added it on there. But I do like how it looks overall. I was going to make the eyes so uh, black with orange, but I decided to make them like that. Everything on him is pretty much a dark orange, especially the hat. I was gonna make a star orange, but it kind of will blend it in, honestly. So I left it like as it is. But I do like how he looks overall. Again, he was a last resort, just like all the others you see right here. And here are the limbs, or the legs, I should say. Of course, they do fit, but I kind of, I guess I'll use these as spare parts for in the near future if I decide to make some more, but I highly doubt it. I wouldn't hold my breath on it. Okay, so let me go over the paints. Now, basically it's the same thing for Nightmare. All I used was a black color scheme, like just black right here. I used the color black for the whole body. Yellow for the top hat. Both, well, basically everything on him that's yellow, the cheeks, the eyelids, the top hat, the bow tie, and the star, and the kneecaps, they're all yellow. And of course, oh wait, no, not, except for the star, but I'll go over that in a little bit. I used bright red for the eyes. The star was painted with King's Gold. See, King's Gold. Or gold, you can use Golden Sunset. It doesn't matter, either, either one. It depends what paint you have. And of course, with the Rockstar 4th Closet Party, it's pretty much simple. I just used white for the whole body. I used pavement for the cheeks. And I believe the star and the kneecaps but you can use black if you want so you don't have to use pavement if you don't have that color available and the other color scheme the inner ears muzzle and stomach i just use pewter gray and also for the toes as well that's pretty much it for that one for our rockstar helpy freddy i just use well 
petunia purple for the inner ears, the muzzle, the stomach, the hands, and the toe or the feet. And of course, I use white for the whole body, as you can see. And you can see for the color scheme of where is it? Uh, the cheeks, the eyelids, and the kneecaps. I use petunia purple and not petunia honeysuckle pink. It looks red on camera, but it's not really red. It's more of an in-between color. And for the star, I just use yellow. I just use yellow for the star. The star. I was gonna make it like pink, but I decided to leave it like that. And of course, for Rockstar Molten Freddy, sorry, I used garnet gray this time. I decided to go with the not really white, making it look a little dirty, at least to me. Garnet gray. Uh, ripe tomato for the hat, inner ears, eyelids, eyes, cheeks, muzzle, and stomach. And black for the star. And the bow tie. Well, I didn't need to paint the bow tie, but I decided to. And for the endoskeleton parts, I used gunmetal gray, the one with the chaos emerald on top. So, guys, that's when I look at Rockstar Nightmare. Rockstar Fourth Closet Freddy, Rockstar Healthy Freddy, and Rockstar Molten Freddy. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more. Bye.